friends. So again, it's beautiful outside. We have our blanket, we have a snack, find a comfy spot, and let's read one of our favorite books. With permission given from Candlewick Publishers, I am going to read, I Will Never Not Ever Eat a Tomato by Lauren Child. Lauren Child is the author, not, not a child. Okay, are you ready? I have this little sister, Lola. She is small and very funny. Sometimes I have to keep an eye on her. Sometimes mom and dad ask me to give Lola her dinner. This is difficult because she is a very picky eater. Oh, there's my dog, I see my dog. <laughs> oh gosh, that's might be difficult. Let's see. Lola won't eat carrots, of course. She says carrots. Oops, sorry. <laughs> Lola won't eat carrots, of course. She says carrots are for rabbits. I say, uh, what about peas? Lola says peas are too small and too green. Only or one day, I played a good trick on her. So, Lola was sitting at the table waiting for her dinner and she said, I do not eat peas or carrots or potatoes or mushrooms or spaghetti or eggs or sausages. I do not eat cauliflower or cabbage or baked beans or bananas or oranges and I am not fond of apples or rice or cheese or fish sticks and I absolutely will never not ever eat a tomato oh my sister hates tomatoes look at her face I mean that does not look like a face of a child who likes to eat these different types of foods hmm and I said, that's lucky because we're not having any of those things. We're not going to eat any peas or carrots or potatoes or mushroom or spaghetti or eggs or sausage. There will be no cauliflower or cabbage or baked beans or bananas or oranges. <gasps> we don't have any apples or rice or cheese or fish sticks and certainly no tomatoes. Oh, he's reaching up for all these different things, but she doesn't look like she's very fond of any of the things that he's reaching for. Lola looked at the table. Uh, then why are those carrots there, Charlie? I don't ever eat carrots. Mm -mm. And I said, oh, you think those are carrots? Uh, hmm, these are not carrots. These are orange twiglets from Jupiter. They look just like carrots to me, said Lola. But how can they be carrots, I said. Carrots don't grow on Jupiter. Uh, well, that's true, said Lola. Well, I might just try one. If they're all the way from Jupiter, hmm, not bad, she said. <gasps> and took another bite. She actually does like carrots, right? Because wow. he's doing a trick on her. Mm -hmm. She likes twiglets from Jupiter, not carrots. They are. Oh, then Lola saw some peas. Ah, uh, I don't eat peas, said Lola. Huh. I said, these are not peas. Of course they're not. These are green drops from Greenland. Mom. Something. <gasps> they hold on, are made out of green and fall from the sky. But I don't eat green things, said Lola. Mom, yes, yes. Can you flip this book over? Yes, there's one um, that has a face. Let's look at the next page. Let's see. Oh, you want me to show you the face? Yeah, oh, I see it. Do you see the face? And the eyes. <laughs> one piece. Has a face. 
Oh, goody, I said, I'll have your share. Green drops are so incredibly rare. Well, maybe I'll nibble just one or two. <sighs> oh, said Lola. Hmm, quite tasty. Oh, uh, they say he's playing a trick on her. So. Mm -hmm. Next, Lola saw the potato. I will not eat potato, so don't even try. Not even mashed. Do you think that's a potato? No. No? You don't think so? I, I don't know, actually. You don't know? Okay, let's find out. Looks like a potato. Let's see. Oh, no, 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 no. This isn't mashed potato. People often think that, but no, this is a cloud of fluff from the pointiest peak of Mount Fuji. Oh, said Lola. In that case, large helpings for me. I love to eat clouds. Mm -hmm. All right. Charlie, she said, those look like fish sticks to me, and I would never eat a fish stick. I don't know. Oh no, those do kind of look like fish sticks, don't they? <gasps> Let's see what they are. Oh, I know that. These are not fish sticks. These are ocean nibbles from the supermarket under the sea. Mermaids eat them all the time. <gasps> Oh, I went to that supermarket one time with mom. And yes, I know the ones. I think I've had them before. Lola said, gobbling. Mm. Oops. And there are, are there any more? <gasps> she liked them. Ocean nibbles. Anything that mermaids eat must be tasty, right? Okay, let's see. Mom, mm. she's playing a trick on her, so, um, that's, so it's, those are the hilarious. Oh, guess what? Then she said, Charlie, will you pass me one of those? <gasps> and I said, what? One of those? I wonder what she's pointing to. I know what she's pointing Let's see, to. Can you see? <gasps> she's pointing to something. I know what she's pointing to. Let's find out. Mom, I know what she's pointing okay, to. Okay, like, <gasps> They're tomatoes. What? What? And Lola said, yes, Charlie, one of those. And I couldn't believe my eyes because guess what she was pointing at. Tomatoes. <gasps> yes, the tomatoes. And I said, are you sure? Really? One of those? Okay, let's see. And she said, yes, of course. Moon squirters are my favorite. They're not tomatoes, they're moon squirters. Well, he's playing a trick on her, so that's how I know. <sighs> I don't know, she's pretty smart too. You didn't think they were tomatoes, did you, Charlie? <laughs> oh, do you remember what this was? Do you remember what these were called? Yeah. <gasps> Orange twiglets. And do you remember what these are? What? Uh, green drops. Mom, but he's older than her, so. Mm -hmm. That's he's... Charlie. See, his name is right there. And these Remember the mermaid food? The ocean nibbles? What about this one? Do you remember what that no. is? No, call it. No, I don't know. Cloud fluff! Oh, yeah. And, of course, the... Tomatoes. Moon squirters! Do you like moon squirters? Yeah. You do? Do you like orange twinklets? Hi. <laughs> okay. Bye, friends. Ha bye! Fun reading with you all.